So I know there's a few of you that like watching me play on the R Gallery map. So most of the challenges today will be here. I mean, not in this one specific session, but across the map. And real quick, I want you guys to think of a challenge I can do for this thing. I've been wanting to do something on this forever, but I haven't came up with a good challenge. So let me know in the comments below or message me on Twitter, whatever. Now there is a curved bench right here. I sort of want to do, I don't know what I can do around it. I want to go all the way around it though. Maybe let's try to do a tail slide. And if that doesn't work, I will try something else. And I'm trying to find a good angle to come at it because I want to do a back tail on it, not a front tail. If I can get onto it, <laughs> I have no idea how I'm going to do this. I think I might be better off coming at this switch just because it's just a better angle. There's less stuff in my way. Like, uh, there's not a big pink blob in my way. The only thing I have to worry about is that little manual pad right there. But I think maybe I can make this work. Oh, I got into, I got into a back tail. <laughs> now I need to find a way out of it. I'm worried that when I pop out, it's going to stick to this. That's probably what's going to happen. And I'm going to have to try to find a way to avoid that. All right, now come out. Oh, wow. I feel like I barely got that. I have to look at the replay. I want to see exactly where I landed at. First, I want to see if I actually got into it at the very beginning. Uh, sort of. I think I'll take it, though. As long as I landed pretty good off of this, which it looks... Oh, yeah. I'm definitely taking that one. So I was pretty sure that that was going to take longer than what it actually did. I landed pretty quick. And I'm pleased with it. Let's go find something else. Let's go ahead and leave this place and find something else. So I think I have an idea right here. Now, I'm not really good when it comes to the vert stuff on here. I'm more of a street skater. Not really vert. But I think what I want to do is try to grind the top of this, gap across this, land into a grind over here, and then land back in. I want to try to make it look as smooth as possible. And I guess I'll start right here and get a running start. I just want to get the speed because I am going to need speed to clear across that gap. But I also need to land into a grind too. All right. Almost. I just need to get out there a little bit farther. Ah, man. Come on. Just go into the tail slide, dude. Yeah, obviously it's not going to give it to me. I mean, I've been trying for a while now and the same thing keeps on happening. So I'm just going to try something different. I think I'll take that. I mean, <laughs> why not? I still think it looked nice, even though it's not the original trick I wanted. It still looked nice, so I'm taking it. So I guess that's okay. You can't win them all. And I'm just going to have to accept that fact, but I will try again later. <laughs> Maybe I'll put it in another video. So the next thing I want to do is gap from here, this little flat section right here, and then over the fence. I want to try to land somewhere over here and I'm probably going to need a little bit of speed for that. So I'm going to try to get on top of that building. And now that we're up here, I'm going to try to find a good place to drop at. I guess about right there and I'm going to set a slide down here and hopefully I have enough speed from that. Okay. Let's try this out. Let's just ollie into it. And I don't think that's going to be enough speed. Well, maybe I'm going to try to do it a couple more times, but I don't think that's going to work. All right, let's try this out. Wow. Yeah. I'm going to need just a little bit more speed. I think I'm just going to go all out and use basically the same setup that I had for the Art Gallery 5 set video. So this is the Art Gallery 5 set. I cleared it from here all the way down to the bottom, flat to flat. I had to gain a lot of speed for that. And so yeah, I'm gonna use the same setup that I used for this stair set on that gap. And if you guys wanna know how to set up everything and how to get to the top of that building, then make sure to check out that video. Okay, so I have everything set up now. I got my container set up and down there, I'm going to try to get a good angle of this. Down there, I got my speed ramp. Maybe I can make this work. So let's try this out real quick. See how well this works. 
Oh, yeah, I got a lot of speed off that. And I didn't even pop. Wow. Nice. Let's try to get this now. Oh, yeah. Man, I clipped right there. I don't want to clip on that sidewalk. I sort of want to land to flat in the street. Okay, this might be enough. Let's laser flip it. Yes, I made it. I tried to power slide to stop myself from falling. I wanted to land that smoothly without crashing or whatever. So I think what I'm going to do is place some broken picnic tables over here and a kick or two just to give me some stuff to work with because maybe I can hop over the fence and still make this look pretty smooth. Oh yeah, come on, land it. Yes, <laughs> I thought the impact might be too much right there. Yeah, that's that's going to be the one I want. That came out pretty well. All right, so for the last challenge, we are now at the Rosalita triple set. I did this video last year. It's actually my most popular video, I believe. So today I want to try to clear this triple set again, but I did get a lot of comments on my last video asking me to do something extra. And what they want me to do is clear across the street. They People were telling me to set up ramps or whatever and do it that way. But I want to try to get enough speed to just clear it from flat and then over this to flat. I mean, <laughs> that's a big street gap, but we should have enough speed to do it. And I also got a lot of comments on that video telling me to just use the speed glitch. I think I'm going to use the speed glitch real quick and uh, get that out of the way because it's so simple. I don't even think anybody should even be watching a video on doing a speed glitch down that stair set just because this stair set's way too small for a speed glitch. Yeah, look how easy that was. <laughs> Could you imagine if I speed glitched every single gap I did? That would be so boring and just way too easy. Now I have found an easier way to get on top of that building. All you need is a launch glitch and the manual pad glitch. Okay, now we just need to land on that. So there was our first launch glitch. Now hopefully, hopefully it will stay there. Nice. And what you want to do is set your marker right here, set up another ramp for the launch glitch, just this large decked ramp. Let's do this. Oh, wow. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to launch up that far, but yeah, you can launch to the top of the building that way. But I had another thing in mind. So yeah, you want to launch up to right there. And when you finally get up here, you want to go over to this little section right here and you want to get the manual pad with the rail. And you want to place it at a good angle because you want to stay up there and you just walk across it. And then the rest of the way up is just manual pad glitches. Like for example, I'm just going to put a bunch of manual pads right here. There you go. And we're just going to manual pad glitch our way to the top. Just like that. And then you're going to do it for this next section right here too. Just like that. We made it up here and... We're just going to leave our marker right there because I want to try to make the manual pads just a little bit higher. That way I can get on top of the whole building. Hopefully that doesn't fall over. And yeah, let's just jump over there. Nice. And now that we're on top of this building, you'll want to do a launch glitch over to the next building. Just like that. I really wasn't planning on launching up that high. Hopefully he'll stay right there. Nice. Okay. He stayed right there. Now I was planning on landing a little bit lower, probably somewhere like right here. And if you do land right here, then you can just do a manual pad glitch until you get to the top. But yeah, once you make it up this high, all you need to do now is do another manual pad glitch and get to the very top of this building just like that. And then you want to come to this back angle right here and jump on top of this. So if you guys can see right there, there you go. You jumped over here and then you'll want to drop down to the next level, which is right there. And then you're going to want to find yourself a good starting point. You want to get like two push max without any ollies or anything like that. You just want to be able to roll off that way. It will remain consistent for the most part. 
and you want to find out where you drop and then that's where you want to set the speed ramp so i got my two pushes now hopefully he'll land into the slide it looks like that's what he wants to do and yeah we'll just keep trying over and over until we finally roll away with one and wow that was pretty quick let's see if we can just roll off okay now I'll pop across the street <laughs> almost so i'm not going to worry about tricks down the triple set i'm the triple set is not the main focus i mean i just rolled completely off of it if you guys want to see more tricks i do have a video and i think i did maybe like four or five tricks down it but yeah like i said the main focus is the street gap but yeah i use other glitches to get to my starting point but i still don't have to use a speed glitch at all for this stair set and that's the main thing oh yeah i think that's gonna be enough speed uh let's try to pop over the street yes i got it right there i thought for sure i could clear all the way down to the bottom of that stair set but it doesn't matter i got over the street that's the main thing And by the way, if you guys want to do this yourself, if you follow my tutorial, it only takes like five minutes, as long as you know what you're doing when it comes to the glitches. I try to make it as simple and as quick as possible, and that's the quickest way that I know of right now. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, make sure to hit that like button. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit that bell so you actually get notified when I upload. Let me know what you think about this video in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.